My name's Drew Pearce and I'm the creator of No Heroics. And this is a tour of the geek detail of my favourite pub, The Fortress. The background reference in No Heroics uh, refers to the history of the whole of comics. Uh, we wanted to do that in pub detail, such as this. Ditko's Origin Ale, a reference to uh, Stephen Ditko, who co-created Spider-Man. The fortress itself is obviously a reference to the Fortress of Solitude, where Superman lives, and uh, the key that's the logo all around the pub is the enormous golden key that sits outside his Arctic wilderness retreat that only he can pick up to uh, let himself in. our invented comic. Uh, the logo is based on different eras of 2000 AD. There is a big 2000 AD theme going on here. Every one of the signs in the fortress is written in the original Captain America font from the 40s. Postcards from some of our favourite superhero cities around the world. Saline Bitter is a reference to Slane, who was a cartoon character in uh, 2000 AD, a mad, bloodthirsty axeman uh, around the late 80s and early 90s. Another reference to Moores, uh, which of course is Alan Moore, and starts one of the big Watchmen motifs, Night Owl. Gamma Meister, Green. Maybe it's a reference to the Hulk. Durham Red. Uh, red wine based on the 2018 character, Durham Red. I've offered Ben, the director, a badge and a blowjob if he can actually get the reference that is White Heat, Ridgeway Bay, Chardonnay, 1968 vintage. Mandia's Champagne, obviously another reference to Alan Moore's The Watchman. Beer's Lager, a reference to Simon Bisley, another brilliant 2000 AD artist. Obviously smoking is bad, but it's better when it's a reference to 2000 AD. Strontz being a reference to Strontium Dog, and Zarjaz being Tharg's favourite catchphrase. This is Grant Morrison, the writer of uh, probably my favourite comic book, uh, Zenith, from 88-89, which also appeared in 2000 AD. However, if Grant Morrison doesn't like the show, then this is a picture of Yul Brynner, and it has nothing to do with Grant Morrison. Warren Ellis, another brilliant British comic book creator who I actually got in contact with and showed the pilot of No Heroic Suit. I never actually heard back from him. I hope he likes it there.